what's good you guys it's your girl cutie and i'm back with another video y'all before we get started let's get into this audio because girl this boy got a lot of nerve okay so we're gonna go ahead and get into this audio real 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 quick okay let me go ahead and play it for y'all have you been having sex with anybody else while you're pregnant no off the church god damn it my damn jacket. Boys, play with me, yo. No, because you know that's right, not true. Done. We done, we done, dog. Yeah. Touch me with those lying hands. You haven't done shit yet. You ain't even seen shit yet. Like, get over yourself. What do you mean, over my show? You're not there yet, baby. You're not there yet. Because you don't want me there. And have a piece of this humble pie. You'll get there. What do you mean, humble pie? You're not there. I made you. Yo. So, anyway, you guys, that is a big point. But this nigga has a lot of nerve, okay? Because how is he telling her to have some humble pie? That's how you know he has good sense, okay? That's how you know he knows what he is doing when he's out here doing what he's doing when the doing is doing, okay? And this clip proves my point of what I've been saying. He is jealous. And how you made Rock a household name when you, you haven't even accomplished that for yourself nor Jaden. So how you made her household name? Rock, let his tail know straight up. She was destined for this. Like she said, she made a way for herself and she passed him up and is running circles around him. And he is hot and heated because Rock realized that he is using her for his own personal gain. This nigga is mad because Rock won't let him use her. And like she said, he said, you're not there yet. Take a piece of this humble pie and you'll get there. First of all, boy, shut up with your long neck and your long head and that long nose and that long mouth and that long out of tongue, uh, long out of tongue, uh, what is it? Out of tune tongue. Okay, girl, I got tongue twisted talking about this dirty dick dog nigga. All right, you need to get it together because Rock, you better than me because I would have let his tail have it, okay? I'm just waiting for the moment where she actually leaves his tail because you know what? You know he's going to have to publicly embarrass Jaden to get back in Rock's good graces. He always got to act like him and uh, Jaden having a hard time or they not in love or they ain't like, uh, in, uh, they're at odds with each other to stay on Rock's good side because Rock is the one with the money. Jaden ain't got no money. Maybe Jaden got a little piece of his heart, but then again, the nigga ain't got no heart, okay? But anyway, Blueface supposed to make an appearance on his mom's show. But y'all, I honestly don't feel like Carlissa's show will do any numbers, okay? I don't even feel like she's going to get a whole a second season, okay? Um, But he hasn't posted it on any of his social medias until recently. At first, he wasn't even promoting it. He wasn't even posting it or anything until she brought up that he would be making an appearance on her show. And I'm just like, what? I mean, you act like he rocked. If he was rocked, then it would have been different. But it's just Blueface. So what an appearance. Just say he on the show because an appearance, somebody may, making an appearance on the show, that mean they somebody, okay? He just blue, red, white, and blue. That's what he is, okay? Um, And his sister's over there saying that she doesn't want to be famous. Um, And this, that, and the third. Well, sis, you won't have to worry because your brother isn't barely famous, okay? So you don't have to worry about that, Kelly, all right? Plus, Kelly said that she doesn't want to do the show. She said that she's just doing it for her mother. But it seems as if both of Blue's siblings do not like him, in my opinion. And y'all, also, it seems like they have a lot of hidden family secrets because, you know, they act too weird around each other, okay? In my humble opinion. And when they live together and are around each other for too long, they get into to fight they get to fight and going back and forth and my thing is too i really think that the siblings feel some type of way and they do have animosity towards blue and they are holding a grudge towards blue because blue was the one that told Krishan to beat his mom and his sister up and Krishan did it okay if he said jump Krishan would say how high now that is dirty and low down all right but Kelly did stress that, you know, um, she is a forgiving person. 
Okay, you better than me because I wouldn't have forgave him. I'm just saying, but that's just that's that's me. Um, but she said that she's a forgiving person, but she just said that she's not trying to, you know, be be on one accord with him. She's not trying to be in a relationship with her brother, or she's not trying to have a bond, a sibling, a sibling bond with him. So if you guys did miss that video, I did play that video of a QA that Callie did, you guys. So y'all go check that out as well. Um, uh, it was a very good QA. She did speak on Jaden. She spoke on a lot of the low down stuff that Jaden did. She did speak on Blueface. She spoke on her mother, and she also spoke on Christian Rock. Okay. So, you know, at the end of the day, you guys, it is what it is. But this is just a it's just a bunch of bullshit, you know. And when I look at the show or these shows that these people have going on, there cannot be that much drama in someone's uh in, in someone's life and in someone's family. I refuse to believe it. A lot of the stuff is for clout. And let me tell y'all why I feel that way even strongly now. Because Blueface's sister Callie, she made a comment and she said, Yeah, she said rock and blue face do a lot of stuff for clicks and views and she said and i quote y'all be falling for it every time all right so if y'all don't believe me y'all go check out my previous video where we did go over that q and a we did skip the if we skipped to the important parts y'all know me i just recorded the important parts everything else i took out because i don't be uh, -uh. i ain't trying to hear all of it i just want to know the important parts but yeah she was basically saying that Krishan allegedly and Blueface allegedly are over here putting together schemes and scams okay but my thing is if you ask me let me tell y'all something a lot of this stuff could be real but i do feel like i was saying to myself i was like man a lot of this stuff seems like it's not real because there is no way that y'all got all this bs going on just like i said about that dna thing with the with the um i mean not dna thing the paternity test excuse me y'all when she took i mean the lie detector test go whatever the hell it is they got so many damn tests y'all excuse me but when she took that lie detector test, Rock looked like that that crew and Blueface ran a play on her because it looked like she knew she was telling the truth. But she was like, wait a minute, ask it again, ask it again. Like, what? Like, no. And she was laughing because it seemed like she like, oh, yeah, y'all got me. Y'all asses like really just ran a play on me. You know what I'm saying? Like, keep Rock, like, you really got to look at Rock. I think Rock be going through shit and try to, like, go for shit because Blueface be making her do it or because she be trying to make him happy. But if you really look at Rock and how she respond, if you look at Rock face, Rock real life be looking like she just be thrown and shit. But she got a lot of people around her that's really influencing her. And Rock is really young. But you can tell in some parts of Rock's life, and I mean this respectfully, because I like Rock. I want to see Rock win, and she's winning. Um, And I want to see her, see her win in a big way. But I feel like Rock, in some parts of her life, if not all, is a yes man. I feel like she's a yes man. I feel like she is always, you know what I'm saying, yeah i do this whatever blue face yeah daddy yeah daddy blue girl whatever blue girls blue boys blue balls i don't know but she uh she's down for it you know what i'm saying she down for whatever he say anything he say she gonna do it and that's what makes it so dangerous but the thing is when he pisses her off she gets to the point to where she got an evil streak though that's why i say rock is one of the ones she's the sweetest girl but baby when you piss her off she has an evil streak just like when her sister was saying it. i ain't trying to get on rock because like i said before i ain't got no problem with rock y'all know i'm just here for the commentary to give y'all what y'all want to hear but i do feel like even with a sister now with the situation with the sisters in the fight i feel like both of them was lying about some stuff you could just tell because their stories was kind of like eh, you know but i feel like both of them was lying about certain details but even with that sister you can't tell about the jealousy that the sister may have when it comes to rock because you can see it in blue face you can see it in blue face. So, you know, it's like when you that young and you have that much money and, you know, you can only help people so far because when you're helping your family and you're trying to make a way for yourself, money only can stress so far. You know, you can't pay for everybody in your family. You know what I'm saying? You can make a way for them to do what they got to do. But at the end of the day, you know, she got to live. I, I believe Rock is taking care of a lot of people and Rock is feeding a lot of people including blue face and his dirty mama okay that eip one two three long back silver back gorilla of a mama he she 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 paying for a lot of people to eat okay so anyway you guys y'all let me know what y'all think about that that is my time i will see you guys in the next one make sure y'all like comment and subscribe peace out